All right. Hey, everybody. Here is your birthday party video invite. No, that's not a good one. Hey, everybody. Here's your video invite from a party that's happening. Um, it's going to be December 1st at the American Legion in Richfield, Minnesota. That's um, Legion Post 435. Um, it's by Veterans Park at 7 o'clock p.m., probably until about 10 p.m., unless we're really rolling and then maybe we'll go a little bit longer. Um, but nobody likes a dragon party, so unless it's a toga party. Ooh. Yeah, because those are fun. So, um, what's this party for? Uh, well, it's kind of close to my birthday, but that's not the big thing. Um, the big thing is that um, it's just, it's, I have a lot of really awesome people in my life and it's a good time to get everybody together, do some fun stuff. Um, we're going to be doing a fundraiser, um, but the main focus of this party is just to get a bunch of people together and have a good time. Because, why not? Because we can, because we're adults. Um, kind of. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, there's gonna be food. Uh, it's gonna be light food, snack food, and cake. And there's gonna be a cash bar. I would love to be able to, you know, drink you guys all up, but there's a lot of people and that's a lot of booze. But I will give you guys soda and water. So that's awesome. The cool thing that's gonna happen with the fundraising is we're gonna have a DJ um, who's also gonna do some karaoke. So the cool part about the fundraising is is that it's gonna be kind of built into what we're doing. Um, when you come in to the Legion, there's gonna be a big wall or a board with a whole bunch of different songs on it. Different titles, different genres, different um, artists, whatever it is. When you come in, Everybody's gonna have to pick a song. You're gonna have to pick your jam, hence the name of the party. You're gonna take that card, you're gonna put your name on it, you're gonna pay $5 into the donation bucket, um, and you're gonna take that card up to the DJ. Here's where it gets fun. Um, okay, so you can do one of a few things. You can either sing it, and I You can lip sync it. You can dance it. That doesn't mean you have to dance by yourself. It just means you're responsible for making sure that at least two people are out on the dance floor or you can sit on it. For example, um, before anybody even gets to the party, I'm going to take the card that says the thong song and I'm gonna take it off the wall, put my $5 in the donation bucket, and then I'm gonna rip it up into like a thousand pieces and throw it in the recycling bin. Okay, that was a little over dramatic. Maybe not a thousand pieces, I can just rip it up into like eight or 16. Not that I have anything against thongs. I really don't. I've come, I've come all the way around on them. I just don't like singing about them or dancing to songs about them. Those are the main things that you can do. So basically what you're doing is you're sponsoring a song and it's your jam. Um, if you have a jam that you want to request, you can email it to Kate's birthdayjam at gmail.com and I will make sure that the DJ gets it on his list of songs that he has prepared. Just because you request a song or request a jam doesn't mean you're gonna get your jam. If you don't get to the party early enough and somebody already took you know your Lionel Richie request off the wall um, that doesn't mean you're gonna get your jam, I'm sorry. You gotta show up, right? Gotta get there. Um, but what we are gonna do is you're gonna be able to challenge that person. If um, I pick Baby Got Back, which will probably happen, 
um, and you wanted Baby Got Back, if I'm going to sing it, what you're going to do is go up to the DJ and you're going to challenge, you're going to tell him I'm challenging this song, and then the both of us are going to sing that song. And whoever is picked to be the not winner, the loser, has to put an extra $5 in the donation bucket. Easy peasy. We're going to, you know, dance off, lip sync off, karaoke off, whatever. Um, that's what we're going to do. Yeah, right? Sounds pretty good, doesn't it? If you're an introvert and you don't like to do any of those things, that's fine. Just put $5 in the bucket and just go sit over in the corner like, and don't talk to anybody. That's fine. Gifts. I don't know, the last time I had a birthday gathering, I specifically asked everybody not to bring me a gift. Um, because, like, I'm good, man. I'm, I'm good. Look at here, I'm going to show you something. Um, I've got, like, a double long toaster. Like, I've got a, it's almost like a four-slice toaster. I've made it. I'm good. I don't need any present. Um, so, but what happened anyway was people brought gifts anyway. So, um, what's going to happen, and here's your fair warning. If you decide, oh, silly Kate, I'm going to bring her a present anyway, because, just because, and blah, blah, blah. Um, if you bring me a present anyway, what's going to happen is it's going to be auctioned off. And it's going to go home with the highest bidder. And that money is going to go in the donation bucket. You can, you know, really don't need to bring a gift. If you decide to bring a gift, just, just know it might walk home with somebody else. Unless it's something really cool. Like maybe a light up hula hoop. I'll bid, I'll bid on it. I'll bid on it. But that doesn't mean I might get it. Um, also, that's just don't bring a hula hoop because I can't. Well, I mean, you can bring one, but I can't. I can't hula hoop. Oh, it's weird. I'm a belly dancer who can't hula hoop. That's your fair warning for gifts. Um, dress code. Wear whatever you want. I don't care. You want to wear your... Wedding dress, wear it. You wanna wear your spouse's wedding dress, wear it. You got a Renfest costume that's just dying to come back out of the closet, put it on. Awesome, do it. You wanna wear your gym clothes? Go for it. The point is I want you guys to feel comfortable. I want you to just come as you are. Whatever you wanna do, whatever you wanna wear is good. Okay, no kids. My kids might be there in the beginning because Slave labor. So um, we're not gonna have any kids. I love kids, but not at this party. So the, the people that I'm inviting, there's people that I have volunteered with. There's people who volunteer with me currently where I work. There's um, people who go, I go to the gym with, people I used to work at the Montessori school with, people who um, are child life coworkers. People who are friends because their kids became friends with my kids back in elementary school. I think some of my family is coming, which is super awesome. Um, and there's belly dancers. Belly dancers. What else do you have to do? You can party with a bunch of belly dancers. Just come, okay? So there really shouldn't be anybody who doesn't know anybody. And if you don't know anybody, just bring a friend. But all these people are really awesome and really fun. So even if you don't know anybody, they're great people. And you'll find a lot of cool people that you want to hang out with and talk with and dance with and stuff like that. So what is Crescent Cove? Um, it's a home that provides respite and palliative and hospice care to children. Yeah. Why did I pick them? Because they need support like everybody else does. So we are gonna have um, a secured laptop or tablet at the party if you want to make a donation that way. Um, otherwise, the $5, the $5 for your jam is really all we're working for. I don't have a goal. We're not gonna try to make some obscene amount of money. The party is first and foremost just for people to get together and have a good time. Um, 
everything else is secondary. I just thought, you know, you get all these good people together, a lot of good people in one spot can do a lot of good. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, cool, now I'm gonna edit this down. It's probably gonna look like garbage. Oh, oh, expectations. Let's just keep them low because I find when I keep my expectations low, everything turns out well, right? Like high expectations equals disappointment equals, I thought this was gonna happen. No, we're keeping it down here, okay? Um, we're all gonna get together, hang out. It's gonna be a great time. I can't wait to see you guys. If you um, wanna request your song or make sure we have your song ready, remember it's Kate's Birthday Jam at gmail.com. Send me an email. I can't wait. RSVP. Tell me if you're coming. It's going to be awesome. We'll all have a great time. All right. Peace.